Hey, it's me from Minerva here, and today we're taking a look at the Millwood Point Press and Clapper. This is a really cool piece of kit that's super useful. It has two main uses. The Point Press, which is amazing for pressing crisp flat collars, mitered corners, and any other narrow points. And also the Clapper, which is used to make super flat seams and sharp creases by absorbing heat from the fabric after it's been pressed. Not only is this a really handy addition to your sewing setup, this is a really quality item. There's a good weight to it and it's a nice finish and you can tell that it's built to last. The Millwood Point Press and Clapper is now available from us and is linked directly below this video for you. If you have a Minerva account, you can click and save it for later. But if you don't have an account just yet, remember it is free to sign up and you'll get that discount code on your next purchase with us. First off, I'm going to show you how to use the clapper. It's amazing for the seams of thicker fabrics that retain a lot of heat after pressing, but it works great on thinner ones as well if you've got a fabric that just won't stay down after it's been pressed. 90% of the time, this is gonna be a really good remedy for that. I'm going to be showing you this on an open seam, but you can also use this on closed seams, flat fold seams, French seams, dealer's choice really. First, what we're going to do is set the stitching by just pressing straight over it so it's nice and flat there. Once we've done that, we're gonna open up the fabric and using the point of our iron, we are just gonna press the entire length of the seam. Once that's been pressed, we're just gonna drop the millwood point press on top and then hold it there for around about 10 seconds or so. Once we've done that, we're gonna take it off and job done, you've got an incredibly nice flat seam. Now I'm going to show you how to use the point press using a collar that I sewed earlier for a shirt that I am currently working on. All we're going to do is take the collar and slide the corner over the point so the seam runs along the length. Now, what we're gonna do is press that seam down and open. As we get up to this corner, we just want to pay very close attention to that and make sure that it's pressed nice and flat. Once we've done that, we can give it a turn, pressing it right into the corner. and then returning it over the points. As you can see, it just fits into that corner really nicely there. So that you can then repress it over the top. Once that's done, give it a turn. And as you can see, the collar's already sitting nice and flat, ready for its final press and top stitching with a couple of really sharp corners and that seam exactly where we want it with no faffing about. So there you have it. That is the Millwood point press and clapper in action. If you wanted to take a closer look, again, the product page is linked just below this video for you where you can also check out all of the projects on Minerva that people have made whilst using it. Thanks for watching and have a great day.